So you want to print out a poster, but we don't have the size paper you need or the printer to make a poster. So I'm going to show you how you can create that poster in Canva. So the first thing you're going to do is you are going to click on the create button and then you're going to select custom. Once you select custom, let's go ahead and change this to inches. And I'm going to put in here my width and height. So I'm going to do 24 by 24. And then I'm going to click create new design. Now that my design is created, I'm going to actually go over to the apps. So I'm going to move down and I'm going to find the apps. Click on apps. And then I'm going to type in split. So I want this image splitter. So I'm going to select that. And then I'm going to select image splitter. And now I'm going to open. So once I open that, I'm going to choose a file that I already downloaded. Select it and open it. And now you see that it's splitting it into nine sections or three rows and three columns. So now I'm going to move down and click on open. And then I'm going to add the images to new pages. And now I have an image that's split into nine sections. So I'm going to wait till this is done downloading, but it will actually create a total. I'm looking for a total of 10 pages. And I say 10 pages because we only have nine, but we already had one open at the beginning. So there's going to be a total of 10 pages here. So I am going to go up to the top now that I have my 10 pages and I am going to delete page one. So now I'm ready to go ahead and download this, these nine pages to print off in sections. So I'm going to go ahead and download it. I'm going to keep it as a PNG file and click download. So now I'm downloading all nine files at once. And once it downloads, I'm going to give it a title. So I'm going to call it Al. And this is a zip file. I'm going to save it. And then I'm going to go ahead and click on that zip file and open it. And then click on the folder that opens. And there are my nine pages that I am ready to print. So now once you have all these printed, you can go ahead and put your poster together.